So, stickers in iOS 17 work much differently, and that's what I'm gonna explain to you right now in this video. So, let's just get started right now. At first, as you know, if you just take any picture, even running the older version of iOS, you can just hold down on it and hold down on the main subject. Like, you can see like this, and it's gonna select it. It's gonna be able to remove the background, and you can see it looks kinda cool, actually. But running iOS 17, the same option still exists, but when you hold down on it, instead of just selecting the foreground or subject or whatever, it also gives you the option to add it as a sticker. On the older version, you don't really have that. You only have copy or look up. So in the older one, you could just hold down on it, like swipe up, get to the messages and paste it there or paste it in the notes or whatever. But right now in iOS 17, when you have this, you have the option to add a sticker. So you basically turn this foreground um, subject into an actual sticker you're going to be able to use anytime. So tap on add sticker and it's going to add it to this list. So you can see this is what it looks like and it added this to some kind of new menu that you probably didn't see before. But here as this one is selected, you have the option to delete it if you don't want to keep it there, but you also have the option to rearrange it in case you want to change it the order, but most importantly, adding the effect. And I want to touch up on the data just a bit because adding the effect is really something that hasn't been here before. If you click on add effect, the original one and this is what it looks like but you also have the option to create an outline and the white outline really adds it at the pop of an actual sticker so in my opinion the white outline looks the best and i'm gonna be using it a lot but you also have the comic which is gonna turn it into some kind of cartoon it doesn't really look that good with every single picture so you have to just try it out it looks good with some images but not with everyone 100 percent then you also have the puffy which basically is like an animated effect slapped on top of it it's like a light reflection whatever you want to call it but this is what it looks like kind of weird effect i guess but this this is what is available to you and the last one is probably something which i also really like a lot except for the outline i think that this is the good one as well so this one is called shiny and it basically just creates this like colorful effect which is animated as well it looks really interesting of course it degrades the quality of the picture but it's just a sticker so you don't really care about the quality that much if you wanted to share like a real picture you wouldn't just put it as a sticker but as an actual photo so these are all the options and now let me show you how you can actually use it because if you go to the to the messages and create a new one in ios 17 you don't really have the swipe through um, user interface where you can choose some photos and pictures and stuff but you have the plus icon next to the text field and this is what's gonna appear when you get to this so you have the camera photos stickers audio location and more but you want to make sure of course to click on the stickers and stickers by default you have the emoji stickers you have memoji and emoji stickers but if you click on this section you can see all of the created ones by you so here are all of them which you can just grab like this and snap it wherever you want so this is where you can use it in real time in real life in uh, the messages this is the place where you're going to be using it the most most likely but for example if you go to like different uh, text messages and different messenger for example the facebook messenger i believe that there you should also have the option to use it the same way but we are still in beta so we're gonna have to wait and see what apple comes up with but this is how you can use it it's very simple because the stickers can literally be created with a few taps right from the photo so i absolutely love it and i think that it's just gonna be a very good experience to use it so that would be about it if you enjoyed this video make sure to hit the thumbs up because i would definitely appreciate it and it would help out the channel as well subscribe so you don't miss future videos like this one and we can see each other in the future thanks all for watching and i'll catch you later peace